what's good y'all welcome back to the channel i'm back with another video for you guys man in today's video i'm going to be showing you how to use some more of the features in menu when it comes to animations now i did previously make a video on how to adjust animations with menu but i did receive a comment or somebody asked me about some of the features that aren't working for the menu animations so in today's video i'm going to be telling you more about the animations and the fixes to the issues so i'm going to start off by going into object spooner and i'm just going to spawn a random a random pet let me just start by uh, adding a random pet, all right? So basically what the comment was talking about was they were saying when they went into animations, they would, uh, let's, let's. <laughs> all right, um, so basically they were saying when they went into animations, sorry, when they went into manual placement to adjust the animations, they said uh, the pitch, pitch, roll, and yaw would not, you know, it would be, it would not work. So to actually use this, what you need to do is, hold on, let me just show you guys that yes, correct, it doesn't, it doesn't work as z x and y normally do so what you need to do to fix this is you need to go to scroll sensitivity and you need to put it you need to go down see how i went i'm going to go back up to the default and pitch roll and yaw will no longer work so what we need to do to use pitch roll and y'all is put the scroll sensitivity down two notches, at least two, all right? And we should be able to use pitch roll and y'all, as you can see. But if we put the scroll seven, scroll sensitivity, excuse me, back at the default, we can no longer use pitch roll. And y'all, we can still use Z, Y, and X. So basically that was the solution to the problem that somebody was having in my previous video, all right? We can also do this with objects. Also, when you guys want to um, keep a object or a person in a certain position, always make sure you check frozen in place. So this button right here is gonna say frozen in place. To activate it, you wanna make sure that you press the green light. You wanna press the button and it should be green. If it's green, that means it's activated, all right? For all the other options, I'm pretty sure you guys know what it is already, but this was the question I think people were having, and this was the problem I think people were having and that they didn't understand. And it's okay, because I didn't understand it at first, but you know, you learn things as time goes on, and you know, that's basically <laughs> how we, uh, you know, how you fix it. So uh, I hope this helps you guys, man. If this did, be sure to smash that like button. And uh, if you didn't check out the video on how to adjust animations or you want to know more about how to use animations in GTA 5 with Menu Trainer, be sure to check the link in the description. I made a video on that and you can check it out. All right. But I hope this helped you guys, man. If it did, be sure to smash the like button, subscribe. Don't forget to turn on post notifications so you don't miss out when I post on the channel, man. I love you guys, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.